Hello everyone, welcome back to Walkthrough, and you're probably wondering, what, 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 why are we in Skyloft, you were at the Elden, uh, Elden province for, but, I done a little bit of gri uh, grinding, no, that's the wrong word, but searching for tumbleweeds to get five, because I do want to upgrade my bow now, because as you've seen, down in Elden, there are a lot of enemies, a lot of archers and whatnot, so I thought, you know what, I'll just get the strongest bow, bow now, so, I got five tumbleweeds off camera, and it's time to upgrade, yes, scrappers still being a pain, I'm afraid, but I was gonna farm for treasures for the sacred shield, but yeah, I don't really need to yet, so five tumbleweed, two evil crystal, three lizard tails, one goddess plume, and a price of 100, do it, my man. I forgot to read the description, but yes, basically this bow is infused with the power of the goddess herself. So go for it. Okay. Very good. Thank you very much, my good sir. You have upgraded the sacred bow. It uses the sacred power of the goddess to rain the terrible force upon your enemies. Oh, yeah. Uh, yes, right now, but I will have, uh, will have something for you soon. I'm not going to talk to Beatrice next because... Uh, her quest might start, I don't know yet. I really hope it starts after I do this dungeon. I mean, there's still time so we'll have to come back here, but still, man. I don't know why... Uh, like I said before, it's the most time... Th I think this walkthrough, or this playthrough actually, is the most times I've actually spoken to her, and she's still not starting the quest. I don't get it, I've gone the wrong way, Eldin's over this way. Uh. Oh well, it's crazy seeing like I got 17 arts now. We've come so far in this walkthrough. I mean, it has been months since I started it. But, you know, if it, if this was a normal Let's Play, seven months. Actually, no, it's only been six months. In seven months, it'll be uh, seven, uh, seven months. Wait, what did I just say? In January, it'll be seven months. Yeah, so, uh, that's what I was saying. But uh, if this was a normal Let's Play... Where I was just playing through it and stuff. That, seven months would be okay in my opinion. Because I'm just playing through a game and fun. But I, this is a walkthrough. Imagine someone is following this walkthrough with me. I can't imagine that. But uh, seven months is way too long. Uh, oh yeah, I know, I know. We're going back to him. Five. Whenever you come up uh, into the sky, you basically leave Scrapper there. And she'll say, head back there quick. So we basically have to lead Scrapper... Uh, I don't know how far up the mountain, but I'm pretty sure it's to the temple, right? How do we get up there anyway? Oh, I see. Yeah, all right, all right. I know where we go. Um, the volcano entry, yeah. And remember when I caught the ladybugs, like when I first dropped her? Uh, there was that pa uh, boulder block in the way where we'd be using that for an amazing shortcut, yeah, so... Don't leave me at press plus to open your map to find me. Okay, I'm sorry, Scrapper. So now that we have the strongest bow, we can kick butt. Uh, I thought that I thought that was gonna take more than one hour, and I was like, what the hell? Uh, heh heh. Pretty good. Ooh, what you drop, huh? Huh? Arrows, very nice. I feel like we've been needing a lot of them. I should have bought a quiver, but yeah. Oh, nice, more arrows. I can't pick them up, so what's the point? So this is the shortcut we'll be using. It's a lot better than going all the way around and whatnot. Oh, that was a nice headshot then. Uh, oh, wow, you guys are quick, huh? I forgot what you said then. It was something like, monsters protect me. Ah, 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 I see ladybugs on the wall. Uh, oh, yeah. In uh, Miraculous, the adventures of Ladybug and Cat Noir, they've actually... Uh, Revealed all the other heroes because there's five now and I'm pretty disappointed by their um, by the choice but uh, How they've introduced two of them so oh no, they've introduced all three um, Actually, I should say even though I'm disappointed with who it is um, Whoa, 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 I'm on fire spin link. Uh, oh, yeah, the arrows protect me because I'm on, uh, They just put out the fire as quick as possible now, so you got me good then, but... Haha. -ha. Ooh, that was nice. But uh, what was I saying? Oh, yeah, they've revealed the new heroes, apart from, like, the other one where the... The other two where the Miraculouses had gone, but... Uh, I kind of like the introduction to all the new heroes they added. 
Like the the people we've met before, but like the introduction to being the hero is really cool. Uh, so let's head up, Scrapper. Let's go. I hope there's not a lot of enemies here that suck, like in this little camp. Uh, oh, there's a mob blend. I think it takes five uh, arrows to defeat the mob blend with the strongest bow. He's like, where? Where did that hit me from? I thought he was defeated then. I was going to say two. Whoa. Three. Wow. Awesome. So, yeah, you really don't want to fight the mob in there. And... We do we still need to do that um, minigame? I don't think we do because that just gives you rupees. Alternatively, if you ain't got no arrows or whatnot, just use these bombs and just throw them on. I think it takes about four or five bombs, I think. I don't know, but we're making our way up. I'm all the way up, or whatever that song is. I don't know. Uh, is there any Waltulas? No. Okay. Oh, two, two art flowers. Nice. This is why the medal is so fantastical. So, hmm, where are we going now? I'm trying to think, because I haven't been in this area a while, so... Uh, I know there's a red choo-choo here. Like I said, I always remember this choo-choo. Oh, it's not your for this path. Oh, there is one, though. Once we get there... Oh, you go around the side? Yes, I think, yeah. Right, I gotta defeat all these archers. Foist. Wow, seeing these archers, damn, did I miss that? Seeing these archers really makes me want to play uh, Hydro Warriors. Uh, I know a lot of people were disappointed with that game. And yes, uh, the Warriors franchise has been a bit... Well, it's been lacking because they're just not... They're just not... Uh, it's hard to explain. There's like no love for the Warriors franchise anymore. Yet they just keep... Absolutely dousing it in uh, DLC and micro tank micro. What? What? I, I didn't even see these. Okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. How dare you? I don't know how much life. Oh, he's injured. I'm sorry, Scrapper. While you may be cheeky, I do not want you to be harmed. But yes, the Warriors franchise is kind of sucking lately. Uh, just in my opinion, I've been playing it. I've been playing the Warriors franchise, it's, uh, specifically Dynasty Warriors. I am dealt too much into Samurai Warriors. I have bought a few of them, but Dynasty Warriors I've been playing since number two. Um, I didn't buy one, or it actually weren't called one. I didn't think it was just Dynasty Warriors or Dynasty Tactics. I think for the PlayStation One, I never played that. I wasn't a fan of the PlayStation One. It did. I did have it. Had a lot of good games, but um, while I'm not like someone who's crazy over graphics I'll, I'll still play old games it's just ps1 graphics really ticked me off just the big blocky um models and whatnot i seen a goddess cave around yeah yeah i think that's where we need to go so I, i'm just gonna play it safe here because is scrapper still smoking no so he does regenerate okay very good oh these are blue ones this time not good but uh oh they still take Oh, I thought I missed that then. Thank goodness. Your hitbox is so huge. Uh, but... Uh, oh, no, no, no. Oh, uh, oh, well, I don't think we need that anymore. Oh, another one of these defeated with three arrows. I don't know if headshots actually do, like, uh, more damage. Oh, I thought I missed that. I think this one's stronger because it's a uh, iron shield moblin, I think. So this one takes five arrows if i'm not mistaken yes i don't know why the iron shield is stronger than the wooden shield mob blame but i guess it is i know there's keys in here and they they're gonna be troublesome to scrapper i think no okay also oh 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 oh, oh. and these are fire arrows too so whoa protect me your rings pretty good <laughs> I like how he reacted to the sound then. Like, what was that? I kind of like how the Moblins look like bigger Bacoblins. Kind of like the Big Brothers to him. That's a nice touch, that is. Oh, yeah, it's another Iron Shield Moblin. I thought it was a wooden shield then. His spear or pike kind of looks like a uh, shovel or spade, I should say. Pretty good. I'm running out of arrows here. I really am. I'm liking these 20 rupees. 
Very good. I think beetles come out here, so I'm going to get my net ready. Uh, aha, pretty good. But if, you, if you're wondering... Ah, yes, they are. Whoa, 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 whoa. If you're wondering where I was farming for tumbleweeds, it was actually at the north desert bird starting. Just so you know, but I think the bad area is where you just come out of the mines uh, in the beginning of the province. Ah, oh, wait, my thumb with my Wii remote. <laughs> but yeah, uh, it's very easy to get tumbleweeds. Apart from when they're way too far ahead here and go into a wall. That's annoying. But to more Elden Ore, I don't think we need this anymore, honestly. And I don't think we need tumbleweed anymore either, which is good. While getting tumbleweed's not bad, but you know. The less we have to search for treasure, the better. Okay, I think we do have to take Scrapper all the way to the big fish, so... Yeah, we do. It's not like a, a cutscene skip there or whatnot, so... Okay, you're fine, Scrapper. Uh, do not... What, 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 what? No, 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 no. Come this way, then. Scrapper! Oh, he's looking at the keys. Uh, oh, I ain't got no ma much arrow, so... Okay, you're annoying. You're really annoying, Scrapper. You are really annoying. You are a really annoying. I think I said that weird, but... Oh, my gosh, no. Is there two twos up in the ceiling? No. Oh. You know what? I'm going to try and... Uh, take one... Uh, take a damage of one. What am I trying to say? I don't know, but I, I think I need to fight it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Scrapper, why'd you come down, you fool? I just... I, I, okay, okay, I don't mind taking it as long as Scrapper don't. Get away then, Scrapper. Oh, my gosh. You were making things so hard for me, Scrapper. I thought he would stay on the little ledge, but no, he's really just following me. What a fool. And I can't believe I couldn't hit that Lizzle Foss with a... Arrow, what a rip. Uh, but I'll destroy you with uh, my arrows. Now I'm completely out here. What's your? I, I'm sure something is supposed to be here. I don't know. If it's something, oh, we get it. Not yet, though. Let's just get. Let's just get. I like how the little heart just sunk then in the lava. Let's just get Scrapper to its destination so we can go back. Back to. Gor. Gor. Wait a minute, is Gorgo the Scrapper? Uh, the, the, not the Scrapper, is Gorgo the Scrap guy? Gorgo the Goron. I'm sure Gorgo the Goron. What's he, his name? I've, I've completely forgotten. Uh, let's see if these have hearts, though. Just rupees. I'm afraid I don't need money right now. There's something I wish I'd done in this walkthrough, and that was put people's names up. Like, as text, but like, slide it across the screen. Like, slide it to in front of them, and then slide it off the screen. I think that would have been a nice little thing. I'm not going to do it now, for because it'll be, like, inconsistent with the walkthrough. Because it's like, hey, I didn't do it in the beginning, so you don't know their names. But no, you know. Uh, but I think I will do it in the next uh, game if, like, they na if like pe people's names don't show up in the walkthrough. I think I'll do that. It'll be a nice touch, I think. But yes, an amber relic. Now we have 40 of them. Okay. Uh, we have the water goggle. So I think Scrapper would just do it himself. Look at the size on it. You want me to put the water on this? No problems. Yes, do it, hero of heavy lifting payloads, whatever. <laughs> oh my gosh. I hope Farron didn't want that bath back. Oh, base in. I shouldn't call it a bath, but... Where did it gone? It must have broke. Oh, my gosh. Did you see that, Mistress Fight? If there's anything else I can do to be of assistance, just call me any time. Fai just says nothing. Fai's just so done. Uh, oh, I like the way she was looking up at him, man. The flame... Oh, I mean, why am I saying her, her text, but... The flame bomb. Yes, okay. Uh, hello, Goko. Are you happy that I got rid of the flames? You are something else, bud. There's nothing you cannot do. You go ahead on it. You go ahead on in. Huh? You go... Shouldn't it be you go ahead on in? You go... 
you head on in? I don't know. You have earned the right to blaze this trail. I don't know why I'm... I'm not trying to crack it or nothing, but it just seems really weird to me saying out. It probably is, right? And I'm just the one being stupid. But I want to see if there's hearts in these. Please let it be. No? Can I actually... I can stand on the windowsill and that. That's cool. I'm not going to get that one. It's not going to hold what I want. Uh, I'm going to go to the first start doing you, I think. That was cool. It's been a while since we've had one of those entrances and I really like the way Link just let out like a big... Like a big breath like that to like, you know, uh, you know, perk himself up, I guess, or be brave, or that's what I'm trying to say. But we are in the fire sanctuary. This dungeon could give me a bit of a problem. And you'll see why. Uh, so let's look around. I think the only collectible in here is like another half piece, as far as I can tell. Oh, but here is a bird statue. Well, I'll go a little bit further in before I do any anything. So... Because I don't have deco seeds, or... Oh yeah, I do. Well, you can shoot these spiky, like, bulb things, and they will drop a water droplet out, and it'll create a temporary pa platform on lava for you. So be quick about it. Uh, I see a treasure chest. A do locked door. Hmm. Okay. Let's just look around. Oh, arrows. Very nice. Oh, a fairy. Gimme, gimme. Oh, I should have bottled you. Damn it. Never mind, I don't mind, I still got two. Uh, nothing on this side, no? Okay. And this is actually going to show you, like, how these bulb things also work when it comes to, uh, like, a lava flow. Yes, it will move to the current of the lava, like that. So, be quick about this, too. Anything down there? Oh, there's... Whoa, whoa, whoa. There's archers there. I think I need it to stay on that. But before I do, I'm going to defeat these Bokoblins over here. Oh, you're moving. Why do I think Bokoblins didn't move? Probably because probably I fought so many archers. Um, I've kind of forgotten about these ones. Oh, no, they are archers. Oh, but they're walking around. Cool. Uh, oh, he dropped more arrows. Damn it. I was too late. But we cannot get through this door, obviously. And there yet, so... I think we do need to stand on this uh, platform. So come on. I really like the look of the water bubbles. I, I think there's a scene in like Bugs Life. I haven't seen that film in so long. Where, like I think it was like the caterpillar was drinking a water droplet. And it just looked so nice. Kind of like when you see lava in films and you want to eat it. Because it's like all gloopy. You know, gloopy goodness. But, you know, don't eat lava, people. You will absolutely destroy yourself in a very painful way, I might add. Your throat would just instantly heat up and you probably... You know what, I'm not getting into this. It's too dark, but don't eat lava. That's what I'm trying to say. Um, hmm. So, is this just to get the chest up here? Aha! Whoa, wait a minute. What's that? Just a blue one. Oh, I thought it was a purple one. Like... It must be because the light, you know, like the red, like glow of the lava or whatnot. Or maybe it's just because it's a dark area, but I remember you attack really quickly after a block, so. Oh, but you're very weak to my sword now. Oh, very cool. So I had to defeat all the goblins, I think, or maybe just that one. Oh, I would have been so happy for this a few parts ago, but not anymore, I'm afraid. But I still appreciate it, nonetheless. So, I'm guessing this is going to be... Oh, wait, there's vines there. Right, remember, there's vines. I think this is going to be a small key. Yes, so to open the door. But I am going to go over to the uh, the other platform there. Uh, just to see what's there. They should have made the vines more bright, I think. Because they're really hard to see from here. Ah, arrows. Uh, anything else? No. Nothing at all. Okay. Oh, Mogma. Ho ho ho! Ah, oh, the exit at last! What? Don't scare me like that! I thought you were one of those monster creeps! Oh, hey, what's this? You got yourself a swanky pair of digging mitts, don't ya? Who are you anyway? What you doing here? I'm on a quest! 
A very perilous one. No, is that the right word? I don't know. Hmm, I get ya. Huh? Me? Oh, yeah. The name's Gold. I'm the big boss of the Mogmas. Oh, so he's the big dog. Uh, I didn't know that, actually. That's kind of nice to know, like how we finally met the lead of the Mogmas. Those digging mitts you've got right there. I invented them. <laughs> no offense, pal, but you don't look like the kind of guy I'd send in you on a treasure hunting mission. Everyone says that. What the hell, man? But what do I know? You might just surprise me. So here's the deal. Wood in the tunnel is there's a huge treasure hidden in these these year ruins. But nobody's who's nobody who's ever seen it has come back to tell the tale. Countless treasure hunters have disappeared in your poof, gone. As a treasure digger, I gotta warn you to just in, turn around and enjoy the many peaceful years of digging left to you, but you're gonna do this no matter what I say, aren't you? Pretty much, yeah. Alright then. I'm going to let you in on an ancient treasure hunting legend passed down among... Wait, I'm going to let you in on... Yeah, uh, of the Mogmas. Every Mogma with a handful of dirt knows this one. Here we go. Ye who seeks the entrance to the king's treasure, look for the two statues that face one another. Show your bra bravery and jump onto the mouth of the sleeping statue. Do this and the path will open before you. You remember all that. And you're golden. I mean, you remember all that, and you're golden. Uh, thanks. Some of my guys are searching around you for tre the treasure. If you get lost, just haul at one of them. One of them. So, thank you, gold. Um, so, we need to find statues facing each other, then be brave and jump to an open mouth one, I guess. So, remember that, people? Remember it. I probably won't remember it. <laughs> Ah, so I think I'll save at this bird statue, but yeah, this is basically the fire sanctuary. It's pretty cool, actually. I was, like, in the crate of the volcano, if you see like that. Kind of like the divine beast on Breath of the Wild. So I think I'll be for it. that'll be it for this part, of course. So thank you for watching. I hope you've enjoyed, and I shall see you in the next part when we tackle this new dungeon.